Hello, this is Louisa, and in this video, we want to talk about effective websites. Websites that get you visitors and leads. Perhaps you may be wondering if it's time to get a new website or to have a website makeover. And the question is, how much should I spend on my website? And how do you know if your website is doing what it is supposed to do? I received many similar questions, and I thought I'll have a live web training event to address some of these questions, and hopefully it will help you decide on what you need to do with your website. There are about 28 million small businesses in the US, and 14 million of these participated in a survey done by Statistic Brain. 75% of those surveys reported that they did not have a website at the time of the survey. That is a rather big figure. Many small businesses, especially freelancers, independent trainers, coaches, teachers, tutors, they're very happy using Facebook pages, which is free to use and very easy to set up. There are also many open source sites that helps host your account for free. Now in the coming training, I'll share with you why you do not want to just have websites on these service providers. Suffice to say for now, whatever you build on these sites do not belong to you. They can be taken down at any point in time and all the effort and time that you spent would have gone to waste. So how about you build your own sites? Most people will be able to do it, but you don't want a site like this. It doesn't really reflect on your professionalism. So let's take a look at what constitute effective website. They are not necessarily fancy. They don't have to be flashy. In fact, they don't really have to be ultra expensive or complicated. On the contrary, they may be quite the opposite. We want our website to attract visitors. So they come visit us and stay at the site. This is our online home. We want them to like it and feel comfortable with it so they can come back to visit us again and again and to catch up with us on the latest news. And they're so happy perhaps that they are willing to leave with us their contact information so we can inform them of new events and updates. And we want to build an online home that people are happy to come to, that they will be happy to bring the friends to come visit us and hang out with us. We want websites that get us leads and new contacts. And that is what I'll be sharing in the coming training. If you're interested to join this training, just check for details in the description box below, or you can take down this URL, which is louisachan.com forward slash hangout dash website dash registration. We will be talking about what constitute effective website. Assuming you do have a website, what do visitors do when they come to your website? So after visiting your site, do they pick up the phone and call you? Do they come visit your office or your store? Do they join your mailing list? Something that looks like this on most websites, where you can leave your email address and get newsletters or updates. Do they engage with you? Do they leave comments on your blog post? Do they buy anything from your website? Essentially, is your website working? Or do your website visitors bounce off, meaning they come to your website and they leave straight away? Do they read the content that is on your site? Do they come back or will they never come back again? If your current website is not doing any of the things we talk about, it's not a welcome home for online visitors, if they can't even find your house on busy street, then join me in the coming web training event. It is live, it is video based, and I'll discuss these important pointers with you. I'll show you what you need to pay attention to and not to be overly concerned with things that are not so important for your business. To register for it, you can go to the site, leave us your details and we'll be following up with you. So it is going to be a short session, about 30 minutes. And if you can't join us live, then do sign up anyway. We'll try to have it recorded. Details are below in the description box. And if you'd like to watch other short tutorials, feel free to click on any of these videos. The live link will bring you to the respective video tutorial. So check this out, get your questions ready, and I hope to see you on the live event.